Hi, welcome to this new tutorial. Today we are going to talk about state and nation and the differences between the state and nation. Nation means a historically constituted stable community of the people formed on the basis of a common language, territory, economic life and psychological makeup manifested in a common culture. According to Blant Shelley, nation is a union of masses of men bound together especially by language and customs into common civilization which gives them a sense of unity. Therefore, a nation is a culturally homogeneous social group whereas the state is a people organized for a law within the definite territory. It is always sovereign supreme internally and independent externally. Now let us understand the distinction between the state and nation. First, nation and state are distinct entities. The nation may not be always a state. Example, India was not a state before August 1947. On the other hand, a state may not always be a nation. Example, Austria-Hungary was a state but not a nation before World War I because the heterogeneous people did not form a culturally homogeneous people. Second, the state is a state because it is sovereign. The nation is not a state if it is not sovereign. Sovereignty is the chief characteristic of a state. It is not a feature of the nation. Whereas a nation becomes a nation state when the nation attain statehood. Next, the state is political concept while the nation is cultural and a psychological body. Nation is primarily cultural and only incidentally political. In short, nation is not political concept, it is only spiritual. Next, laws bind the people together in a state. Whereas, sentiments and emotions binds the people in a nation. To put it in simple words, the unity of a state is always external. Whereas, the unity of a nation is always eternal. Well, in the case of a state, unity is imposed. It comes from above through laws. Whereas, in the case of a nation, unity comes from within through emotions. Next, there is an element of force connected with the state. The state laws are binding. There is a coercion exercised by the state if its authority is defied. Whereas, in the case of the nation, there is the element of persuasion. Next. The elements of the state are definite. The element of the states are population, fixed territory, government and sovereignty. Whereas the elements of the nation are not definite. Examples. Somewhere common language help constitute a nation. Whereas somewhere else common race make a nation. And last, a state may be larger than a nation. The former USSR had within it more than a hundred nationalities. Conversely, a nation may be larger than a state. A nationality may spread over two states. And the example is, the Korean nationality is spread over two states, North Korea and South Korea. I hope you have understood the distinction between the nation and state. If you like this video, then do give us a like. Do share this video to the larger community of political science students. Please do comment and voice out your opinion. And last, do subscribe to the political science tutorial. See you soon in next tutorial. Till then, have a great time.